Welcome guys to a brand new video on solo leveling arise. So in today's video, what I'm going to be doing is going over every single way we have to get essence in this game. Now essence is exactly what you need to summon on the banners. Now, obviously smart decision is to not use your essence for the standard banner. Now I've done that, but I am a pay to play player so I can get my rewards or get the resources back so I'm fine with that but if you guys are free to play absolutely do not use your SS stones on this standard banner I know you guys want to say like oh look I'm one one a multi away from getting to pity or you know getting my guarantee don't use your essence guys you need to save as much as this as possible because right now I can't exactly say the game is going to give you a lot of essence moving forward after you've completed every single content so essence are very very vital and important and you need to save it for the rate up banner now I really really hope that when global comes out the banner system changes because honestly no, no amount of essence will help with this terrible gacha system where you don't actually get a guarantee for that specific character you're summoning for so it technically means like the essence we have can go down the drain and not get the character even if we used over 100k essence now the chances of that happening is very unlikely but there's still a chance of that happening and since this is a gacha game the rates are never on your side but let's go ahead and take a look at every single place we have that uh, we can get some essence for now obviously as you're starting out the game there is going to be a lot of essence being i say a lot of um good amount of essence from this story so completing the story will give you essence obviously getting the uh, free stars essence are given for each individual missions as you can see you get 15 over here so yes as you progress in you get essence from it here you also have no more no more and hard same exact thing you get essence from here make sure you do the side stories as well so this is where you can get essence um the only thing is this is only a one-time reward so i am currently in uh chapter 12 or 14 13 damn so i'm gonna get to chapter 14 soon and then it's gonna be chapter 15 so this is all one-time rewards so i'm hoping the game also has better ways to get essence which we will cover hopefully right now so we also have the hunter's archive so even if you're not playing this guys make sure you guys are come on i didn't mean to use it now make sure you guys are doing this because every day you get a set amount of keys we're going to be exiting ex, ex, exiting out so you get a set amount of keys that you need to use so you get one key every single day but there's five missions technically and um, you need to basically unlock each individual stage you can use your keys but that's another place you can get some essence um, as you can see so by doing this you get some essence over here do the same thing for this character this character this character as well there we go um wait a minute have i done a lot oh my days i'm an idiot okay just skip this skip this perfect hey how many oh I've, i don't remember doing this i honestly i can't even lie but yeah there you go uh, so make sure you guys do this uh more characters will be added in here i'm guessing some sr units as well hopefully when ssrs get added inside this onto archive we can possibly get some better rewards as well not just essence but hey it's good to dream okay so we can get essence from there we can get essence from encore missions the same way by just completing and, and pre-starring it so right now i I've done all of the missions, but as you can see, I can go back and just get uh, free start each individual missions. So that's again, I can get this. Um, but I wouldn't use it now because I do need the end core keys for my farming to make my account stronger. So I'm not going to go back just to farm all of this stuff, especially when the levels are only level 30, um, when I can just farm this ones instead. Um, better levels. Um, break. Yeah. So in general, I'll probably just farm this instead. So I need all my. Um, all my keys but yeah this is another place you can get um essence but it's, once again it's only one time um one time one time gates well actually we'll take a look at that later on essence is the same thing as the end core as well um oh sorry instance dungeon sorry is the exact same as well where you can get essence from completed missions once again only one time so have you guys have noticed there's a lot of one time only essence ways so gates recharges or refreshes every single day if i'm correct you can't really get essence from exactly the gates as you can see over here however you can get essence from here as you can see so every time you complete a gate um you have a chance of getting uh, mining or dispatch mining and if you get an s1 you actually get this you can actually get some essence um you have some a ones you can get essence only the b ones don't give you essence so uh i don't know if you need to challenge 
A or S only to get this stuff. If that's true, then I'm just gonna focus only on A and S to get some essence. Now, how many essence can you get? I've seen get I've seen myself getting like four, five, but this is still alright, anyways. Um I think it's alright. So this is actually a consistent way, a little consistent way to get essence in this game. So it's not a huge amount, but it is consistent, which I do appreciate. Okay, so that's the mining stuff. Uh don't forget to rescan. If you don't see anything good, just do this. So um these are all b okay this is b this is s i'm definitely going to do the s one um yeah i'm going to do that one uh and then if there's like any of these blue ones i might not do it but there's some stuff i actually do want to grab from here though actually no look um yeah i could actually because this is also useful and this as well huh this one's only gives me this ones so i should not ignore the blue ones especially when you need this stuff Damn. Oh, there's a good amount of gold you can achieve, but it's also limited to 12 a day. So take that as you will. Okay. Um, anyways, yeah, essence from there. Now, let's take a look at the other stuff that you guys might have not unlocked right now, but uh, also give you essence. So obviously in here, actually this one only really gives you essence from the, the missions. There is no essence from like the, uh, the actual main reward, which I don't actually like. They could have given us like 500. Ooh, they give us a lot of this, which I do want, huh? Okay, um, there you go. Sorry. There is no essence in terms of main reward, but by completing missions, you do get some essence. I wonder... This doesn't refresh, right? I'm just opening this up, sorry. You guys won't be able to see it. I hope... Is this just like a one-time thing and just keeps getting better? Um, it doesn't say refreshes yeah okay this doesn't refresh okay that kind of sucks anyways we go back uh we have the battlefield of time and we can get some essence from here as well now it's based on like your overall rankings over here as you can see now i don't have any history but the rewards are over here so rank one get 1000 rank two 900 um essentially you want to rank pretty good Top 10 gets 500. Um, at least get top 30, guys. That's, well, I'm saying at least, but I don't know how the ranking is based. Is it entirely the server or what? I, I'm not sure how this is done so far. But uh, you do have individual ranking in here as well. However, this one doesn't actually give you any essence, if I remember correctly. Yeah, no essence from here. What is this? Season points. Okay. Yeah, you get no essence from here. The group ranks. Um, reward oh you do get essence from here though from the group rank um top 20 so i'm getting i'm getting no essence okay you need to be top 10 to get essence that sucks that honestly sucks i won't even deny that that sucks why only give essence to people here that sucks that honestly sucks i don't like that um it's only like a small amount but still every little helps guys <laughs> Um, every little reward actually helps you guys um, so I think they should definitely bump up the rewards as well actually um, so that everyone can actually get some type of stuff because this is ridiculous honestly the difference in uh, rewards from each individual rank is too huge in my opinion actually that is something I don't like because yes even if there's a game that uh, is like against other players the thing is, the rewards should technically not be like a huge difference between each one of them. Um, but now you can see there's a huge difference, which is also something I do not like. And uh, it could call to question how much actual free-to-play essence stones can we actually get. But yeah, I don't like that. But anyways, you do have some achievement rewards over here where if you are able to collect within 1 minute and 30, you get 50, 40, 30, 24, 25, sorry, and 20. Um, so yeah, you get essence in there. I believe this refreshes every boss. So, yeah, it refreshes every boss. So this one is ending in six hours. I'm gonna try and push as high as possible, um, but I'm seeing people clear it in one minute and 26. That is insane to me. Uh, three minutes is the, oh, I don't even know if I can. I need to power up my account, to be honest. Um, divisions. Yeah, okay, cool, whatever. Okay, that's Battlefield of Time. You have other ones that open up as well, by the way, as you can see. Um, you do get this season points as well, which um, I'm guessing 
does it have something to do with the rewards over here i'm not sure but you definitely want to get at least like top 30 top 50 to get some good amount of essence but yeah you can get essence from there there is also this but it's not available right now it's 49 days before it becomes available so it gives us enough time to start working on our accounts and get it strong but we do have challenge over here um rankings rewards there is no essence from there group rankings as you can see there is essence so there is actually see look there is not much difference in okay, okay obviously the blue ones are very precious and good but like still i still prefer this like the distribution of rewards from essence at least there you get something um and then you also have achievement rewards which doesn't give you essence so that sucks um cool um there's also different ones as well as you can see so you get essence from there now there is one i haven't unlocked right now which is i have to clear chapter 14 but you are definitely going to be getting essence from here i want to see how much essence we can get from here because this is looking like the main seasonal content but this game has a lot of stuff to do actually um and then we have two other stuff that isn't hasn't come out yet but if you take a look at the roadmap all of this stuff should be coming out within the next six months of the game so more ways to get essence which will be very very helpful and from the roadmap it also shows us that we will be getting one limited character every single month so we only have to technically summon for one character every single month um take that as you will so when it comes to resources every single month we only get one banner now i'm not, I'm not sure how exciting the game would be when because to be honest gacha games get exciting when you get characters coming out and if it's only one character a month how truly exciting can that be i'm not sure i'm not sure um but yeah so if you first have to take a look at the duration of banner it's one every month um or every four weeks or something like that and uh, just make sure that you have essence to at least summon and do one rotation the pity should carry over because the draw of the same time share draw points so this should remain the same for the the specific rate of banner so even if you you know can't complete 80 summons or 70 to be honest you wouldn't really reach 80 summons you will usually get your first ssr after 64 like in honestly if you do a multi straight after like 60 summons there's a really good chance that you'll pull an ssr so you really have to reach 80 guys um but still yeah to that as you will I, there definitely needs to be a guarantee in the banner though okay um there's other ways to get some essence as well dailies um they do give you some daily um essence from i forgot where it is but it's either in bonus or missions um no, no it's not missions it's in special yeah you get like I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it's like in bonus they give you 10 of the essence every single day um we also have this ranking over here so this actually refreshes every single time and you get a set amount so honestly this is good like if you get all the way to 1500 you get 70 750 every single week this is something that people haven't actually talked about but uh, this is actually a really consistent way of getting essence as well um so you definitely want to increase your your battle power over here or your well, trophies whatever um so i definitely actually want to get to fifth 500 before the next rewards are distributed but this is good um i don't know if they give you individual ones for here not really just just a wall of fame okay that's fine but uh yeah definitely pay attention to your progression guys because you do get extra rewards um i don't think this one gives you any essence yeah no essence from here um obviously you've got daily missions i don't have to explain to you guys but daily missions weekly missions as well Wait, did, did the week just reset? Or is it every time I claim this completely, it resets? Because I remember completing this completely. Ah, there isn't... Oh, so weekly missions resets when you complete it. And then you, it refreshes for you. Oh, okay. Okay, that's fine. Um, let's see. Is there any other ways? Oh, yeah, obviously codex. So when you pull weapons or shadows or... Is it shadows as well? The shadows give you yeah shadows um hunters you do get essence as well but this is once again a one-time stuff um the rest of them don't give you here we also have missions as well uh so not missions um achievements over here so common collect growth and dungeon so you can get some essence from here um essence from here essence from here and you get actual tickets though uh, this is only one time again because you need to clear the contents to get that so there's no essence from here actually 
So only essence hint here where you can advance hunters, level up Song Jin Wu. Um, so yeah, we do get some essence from there. Codex done through gone through that. Uh, challenges as well. Obviously, guys, uh, this is also a one-time mission. You have to complete all the way to chapter 12 and you get every single reward from here. But there is essence you can find in here as well. Um, but a lot of other interesting items you can get as well. But once again, this is a one-time feature. Um, so yeah, work through this as well. Um, let's see. Special commissions as well. Now this is for tickets. I'm guessing if you fight a certain... Oh, you can get essence as well. So defeat certain amount of enemies, you get uh, points. And then you get a lot of essence from there. And then you can get some tickets from here as well. Damn, I haven't even gotten one. Damn, okay. That's gonna be a while. Um, armory, let's see. There's nothing from here in terms of essence, I remember. Battle class, perfect. Yeah, every time you power up, guys, you do get a set amount of essence, so 300. As you can see, it keeps moving up and up. So, yeah, don't worry. You keep getting 300 every time you get a significant boost in your power. So, my next one will be when I get to 119k. Perfect. Going over to tutorial as well, don't forget about this, get some essence from here, perfect, go over to this one, go over to here, oh my days, perfect, done, there you go, essence, we want essence, oh, events as well, I, how could I forget that, so we do have, uh, oh, this one doesn't actually give you anything but gold on this, they should have actually added essence in here, but okay, special dice, Instead of essence, you get tickets instead, which is perfect as well. Because at the end of the day, you really want to use the essence for the tickets only, uh, for this specific ticket. So perfect. Um, you could get some stuff there, and uh, yeah, 20 days. Hopefully, we get some more events that are actually good because the rest of them suck, like this ones. Now, obviously, I'm ranking high, but because I'm paid to win or play to play, um, doing this is kind of easy to do actually. Because I have been saving a lot of my characters. Uh, dupes so if i do pop a character it actually gives me a lot of points and that's why i was able to get this so for my sr units i was actually able to dupe them up for quite a bit as you can see as you can see so that's how i got the points but still this is a no it's not a good way honestly i've already made a video talking about how bad this event is even reaching 1000 points is on highly unlikely for free to plays but hey this is a place you can get some essence and some tickets um yeah okay we also have the same one for weapon growth as well and you can see some tickets and this as well this just sucks this event sucks as well um let's see nope nope okay perfect perfect good okay i think that's all the real ways to get essence in this game so let me know down in the comment section if you think that is enough or you think there's more i think okay initially when i was making this video i was skeptical on how much essence we can get but it's looking quite good like oh decent decent especially when we don't even have those two unlocked i think we should be able to get decent amounts especially when we only really need to summon once a month i think that is good especially when the banner duration is long i think many people will actually have a good chance of getting the characters um i think that's why they probably didn't want to go with guarantee because you will be able to get a lot of summons especially when the banner has been out for two months um one month sorry but still guaranteeing a game is always good even if it's like okay guarantee after the third full rotation or something like that having a guarantee is always good but um yeah it looks good okay perfect uh let's see yeah okay that's fine okay there we go hopefully you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe uh, it's been a boy ac oh wait a minute forgotten about these characters so every single day i believe you get five essence from specific um characters in here so as you can see five essence um yeah, i've already claimed the rest but yeah make sure you go over to here and just like claim all the stuff perfect it's been your boy ac gamer don't forget to like and subscribe and i'm out